Welcome to Filmmeister Gaming. On this channel we'll be doing reviews, game guides and let's plays uh, with all the games that I'm playing at the moment. Today I'll be reviewing Terraria. Terraria was originally released in 2011 on PC and has since been released on consoles, handhelds and mobile. By April 2020 the game had sold over 30 million copies which is crazy. The team over at ReLogic has just released the final update and content to the game this month so I wanted to give you guys my review. Terraria is a 2D side-scroller game that is based around exploration, building, crafting, combat and mining. This game can be played both in single player and multiplayer modes. The art style is similar to 16-bit games from the Sega Mega Drive 2 and Super Nintendo. I started playing on the Sega, playing Sonic, so that's why I must um, be into this game. The game starts off with creating a character. Picking male or female, um, hairstyle, customization, change the color of your hair, eyes, and, and clothes. Um, <clears throat> then you choose what world you want to play in. So normally I play on uh, a small world as it doesn't take too long to get to the sides of the of the map and uh, also deep underground where you need to go down below to the hellfire zone. Um, so yeah, this, um, this time I, I chose a small world when I tried a new one. I started playing this game um, in 2014, 2013-2014. Um, and I've got multiple characters um, and worlds. I picked it up again in 2017 playing multiplayer with my brother on a new world we created for multiplayer um, and also made an expert world as well which makes the bosses harder to kill as they have more health um, but they drop better loot so that's the trade-off. Um, then in the end of last year I um, came back to Terraria because I was looking for a game to play and I thought let's get back into Terraria because I never really finished it. This game has limitless playtime. You can get creative as you want. You can choose a theme and match how you play your character you create, whether it be melee, magic, or ranged. Um, I've clocked around 167 hours into this game so far, and I reckon I'll eventually get to the 200 plus mark as I haven't touched any of the new content yet. Now the final verdict, I give this game a 9 out of 10. It's very easy to play, easy to get into and get hooked. The crafting is really easy. You can use the in-game tutorial or you can use the online wiki which I keep open at all times while I'm playing. There are so many ways to play. You can progress through the different areas and defeat bosses and gain new armor and weapons and crafting materials or you can just build gigantic castles and crazy themed areas. That's it from me guys, Filmaster Gaming, giving this game Terraria 9 out of 10. Um, if you like the video, hit, it, hit that like button. If you want to see any more videos like this and future content, hit that subscribe button. And also click the bell so you get the notifications of when new videos come out. I hope to keep doing this. Um, let's, get, let's stay creative, let's keep each other entertained. And let's, uh, let's get into it, shall we? Boop!